name's Matt Buckingham and I'm an author and illustrator and today I'm going to read you a story that I illustrated for an author called Paul Bright. This book is called Nobody Laughs at a Lion. In the cool of the morning on the edge of the jungle the animals were as busy as can be. They were running and racing climbing and clambering, crawling and creeping all over the place. Pa Lion sat and watched. You can see why I'm king of the jungle, he said. It's because I'm the best. Do stop boasting, said Ma Lion. And if you are the best, what are you the best at? Pa Lion thought for a while. Well, running for a start, you just watch. Pa Lion bounded off through the long grass, sending the other animals scattering in fright. As Pa Lion ran, the sleek, long-legged cheetah raced past him with ease. And Cheetah laughed. He laughed quietly, because nobody laughs out loud at a lion. But Pa Lion heard him. All right, said Pa Lion, rather annoyed. Cheetah might be just a little bit better at running, but I'm the best at... at climbing trees. Look! And Pa Lion dug his great claws into the nearest tree and scrambled and scratched and scrabbled and slowly heaved himself up onto the lowest branch. Uh, of, of course, some trees are more difficult to climb than others, he said. Monkey was swinging by his tail in the highest branches of the tree and he saw Parline climbing and he sniggered. He sniggered quietly because nobody sniggers out loud at a lion. But Pa Lion heard him. All right, said Pa Lion, grumpily. Monkey might be just a little bit better at climbing trees, but I'm the best at... at creeping through the long grass, quiet as quiet. Pa Lion dropped into a low crouch then crawling and creeping, slow as slow, and as quiet as quiet, he moved through the long grass. Snake was slipping through the grass, smooth and silent as a sigh. He saw Pauline crawling and creeping, and he smiled. He smiled to himself, because nobody smiles at a lion. But Pauline saw him. Pa Lion was beginning to feel very angry. All right, he said. Snake might be just a little bit better at creeping through the long grass, quiet as quiet. But I am the best at... at... You are very good at sleeping, said Ma Lion. Sleeping doesn't count, said Pa Lion. Then he said, I am the strongest, watch me. He pushed his great head against the trunk of a small tree, bending it until it broke with a loud crack. Elephant was plodding past, leaving a trail of flattened bushes and broken trees in his path. He saw Paul Lion and he lifted his trunk and trumpeted. He trumpeted softly, because not even an elephant trumpets out loud at a lion. But Pa Lion heard him. Now Pa Lion was furious. All right, he said. Maybe Elephant is just a little bit stronger. But I am the best at... The best at... Oh, I can't think of anything. It really makes me want to... And 
the sound of Paw Lion's roar rolled and rumbled and grew and grumbled and echoed and thundered throughout the jungle. Paw Lion really was the very, very best at roaring. Cheetah stopped laughing, a monkey stopped sniggering, and snake stopped smiling, and elephant stopped trumpeting. And Paw Lion was happy at last because nobody laughs at a lion. I hope you like that story, and there are lots more stories to look at if you go to my website. Bye bye.